Hi everyone, it is Lindsay from Rented Space and today we are doing a, apparently I can't talk today, um, it's Lindsay from Rented Space and today we're going to do a bulk food shop. Um, so basically I've done an online order and got it delivered and it isn't everything but it's a lot and a lot of it is to stock up my fridge, freezer, pantry. Okay, so some of it's just things that we needed, some of it's I'm trying to get ahead. Being this time of year, it's tax time, um, there's also specials, and I know that prices are going up, so when it's on special, I'm trying to buy it in bulk and put it away so that the pantry is full for those times where we need it, but it's not cheap. Anyway, so, um, like I said, some of it's just staples, some of it's things to make, you know, cupcakes, dessert sort of things. Anyway, so, Join us and or join me while I take you around a big shop's pantry stock up plus you know just daily needs. Obviously, there are five of us here. Um, there's myself and my husband and our three teenage children, and our son is 19, our eldest daughter is 17, almost 18, and our baby is 14, turning 15. So you can imagine they're not kids anymore, they eat large amounts, especially you know the 19 year old son. So Let's get into it. So, um, I'm just gonna turn you around. So I'll just show you what we've bought. So some of it isn't things that uh, I'm gonna go through very fast, but other things it's just good to have. So sugar, for instance, um, I know it's about to go up, so I bought two bags of that, so that's two two kilo bags. Now normally I, well I used to buy everything in, you know, my flour and my sugar. I used to buy all in 15 and 25 kilo bags. But I haven't actually been able to get to the um, wholesale food place recently. So that is something that um, I'm hoping I'll be able to do while I'm doing a short stint doing six to threes. So, But anyway, I grabbed this anyway just in case I don't make it there. So two lots of two kilo raw sugar. Now I did buy four lots of the Long Life Skim Milk. Uh, not only, you know, do we drink... Well, I drink skim purely because I have, um, I probably shouldn't drink milk to be honest, but the skim doesn't have such a cream content, so therefore I just do that. Plus, when my in-laws come, they actually prefer this, so if I have it on hand, it means that even if we've got full cream milk in the fridge, they will drink this, so I've got milk whenever they come. Now, I did buy four bags each of the self-raising flour and the plain flour. Yes, I only bought the Woolworths because I'm trying to stock up my pantry. So, I'm trying to ensure that I have a lot there. Um, and that way, when I need it, it's there. Um, when I do, I will be going and buying some from one of our, our local bulk suppliers. So, I am planning on getting that next time. But for now, that will do us. Now I've bought a fair bit of pasta because it was on sale, it was the two for three dollars and you know when it's two for three you, you buy heaps of it. So I bought two lots of the, the fatter spaghetti, you know it's the hollowed out stuff so I bought two of those. I also bought two of the size 12 fettuccinis. I bought two of the, the piccolo, like the pasta elbow things. I bought two of the penne and I bought two of the sp small spiral, so it's just the small spiral there. Sorry about the light, unfortunately I'm kind of losing the natural light. Um, anyway, I bought two small tins of the diced tomatoes. Again, it was on sale, so I grabbed it while it was. It was. And I also bought four tins of this. You can't see it all, but one, two, three, four. This is the um, Mutti um, finely chopped tomatoes. Now, again, this was on sale, so I did buy them. Normally I buy these in like the two and a half, three kilo tins from the wholesale. Um, I know I like it, so Coles, uh, Woolworth, sorry, had it on sale for these tins, so I grabbed them. I grabbed a few of the red wine garlic bolognese sauces. These are great for when the kids have friends come over, um, or if, you know, people turn up and I wasn't expecting, I know I've got, it's a meal I can throw together really quick, and it's, even mince if it's frozen, it cooks up pretty fast, so... You know, having pasta and, and that kind of thing means that I know at a at a pinch I've got food ready to go if I need it. And then again, the dolmio, the big ones, the tomato onion roast, these ones here again were on sale, so I grabbed a couple of those. Uh, the golden crumpets, 
So I did actually buy, <clears throat> sorry, I did actually buy um, uh, eight packets of these, but the my husband and the kids and I actually have already eaten three packets, so that's what's left. We bought four lots of the English muffins, so these will be breakfast throughout the week. Um, <clears throat> I do freeze them. Uh, excuse me, sorry. <clears throat> Um, I do freeze these. I freeze them so that we just take out what we need as we need, as we want to use them. Uh, same as the crumpets, I'll freeze them as well. And then, um, you know, we can use them just plain and have them with butter and Vegemite. We can make bacon and egg muffins out of them, whatever we choose. Now, all the Regalito um, pre-made fresh pastas were on sale, so I did buy them while they were. Now, um, I got... Two of the, just the regatta, the ravioli, the Australian beef one. I've got two of those. And I've got two of the ricotta and spinach. Then I also got two of the spinach and ricotta in these ones as well. And again, you know, these cook up quick as it's something I can pull out of the freezer and I've got it ready to go. Um, I also bought um, these ones. Now, these are... It's again, it's the spinach and ricotta for the lean. But these are smaller bags, so these are actually really good for me to take to work for lunches. I can actually split this bag into two containers, and that gives me two meals for work. So um, it means that when there's no leftovers, I've still got a nice, you know, cheap, easy, quick meal for me for lunches. I've got two packets of the fresh hockey and noodles. I've got the thin ones. I like them better than the thicker ones. Um, I did buy four packets of 750 gram shortcut bacon. Now this will go into potato bake, bacon and eggs obviously, um, creamy bacon carbonara, and then I've just also got a spare one in case I need it for, or I feel like doing something with it. Now I did have two lots of the pepperoni, but my kids opened it already, the other one already, while I was doing a pantry clean out. Um, so they've made, there is two of those, but anyway. I, and I actually grabbed the wrong cheeses. I thought I grabbed the one kilos, but it turns out I grabbed two of the 500 grams. I seem to do that a lot when I do it online. I got two of the cottage strawberry jams. Um, I got some round Devon from the deli. I got some ham off the bone again from the deli. I got some margarine. Two lots of the baking cabri chopped chips. Um, they were on sale and I don't know why I only bought two because I go through them not, like nothing. So I'll probably put another order in and get some more. I grabbed these. These were on sale. I went for hundreds of thousands but these popped up and these were only like $1.30 for them because they were on clearance. Um, so I did order two. I only got one but that's okay. Um, I also got some vanilla extract and I got two lots of the muffin cases because I will turn these and some of that flour into muffins for my kids um, for their school lunches. Well, Mia for lunch, school lunches, Michaela for TAFE lunches, Jai, for, Jai Jamie and I for work lunches. Um, I did get some um, uh, Pink Lady apples, two lots of strawberry, one lot of vanilla. Again, I thought I'd bought two and two, but I didn't. As you can see, Miss Mia and Michaela have already been into the, uh, the two girls have already been into the vanilla. And I bought four lots of the milk. I bought some bananas. Now I did buy four lots of the cappuccinos. I've said this before, my husband and my son love it. And you know what? It's it's a catch-22. I don't really like the, the mess that it makes, as in, you know, they're not very environmentally friendly. But budget-wise, $3.50 for 10. That works out at 35 cents per coffee, opposed to them buying a coffee for $5 to $5.50, depending on where they get it. So. It saves a lot of money in our house. Now to get some pizza bases. Um, again, this is where the pepperoni went. And there was also a bag of mozzarella cheese and that disappeared as well. Um, so I did have four bags of these, but they went to um, pizzas for lunches. And I bought a whole heap of soft drink. Now I bought this for multiple reasons. One, you know, the kids have friends come over. But we actually have a big pile in our backyard that needs to be burned off. And... I'm hoping to do that in the next week or so. So we figured we'd buy the, while I was doing it and having it delivered, I'd just buy a whole heap of soft drink. And that way when people come, there's soft drink, I don't have to worry about it. 
So, um, don't actually tell anyone I've hidden some away. Like I will hide some of this away so that they don't. Now I also like the sparkling mineral water. Sorry, I like the sparkling mineral water so I also bought some of that as well. But there you go. So, that there. And all of that's only come to like 400, uh, sorry 400. $348 so it is a lot it's not you know cheap but like I said I got my tax and I went well I'm going to do a bit of a bulk up and try and get some stuff while I can so so um, like I said it's just you know it is a bit of a pantry and freezer bulk up I do have the markets this weekend so uh, the farmers market so I'll try and get there and buy a lot of fresh fruit and veg but for now at least i know that i've got stuff in the pantry if i need it i have things in the freezer for quick meals um at the moment yes i'm doing six till uh three o'clock um so i am getting home in time it's not so bad but i will only be doing that for so long and i'll go back to my um my eight till five which means i'll be leaving in the dark and getting home in the dark so um while i have that chance i thought i would try and get a lot more done at home and stock up on the quicker meals so that I I can you know why not when you've got the chance to that's what it's about prices everyone's saying prices are going to go up so I'm taking advantage of sales now so that if they do go up I know I've got food anyway thanks so much again for joining us today please press that thumbs up button um, subscribe share write comments um, is there things here that you do buy? Is there things here you don't buy? Is there a reason why f that? Um, anyway, thank you so much and I hope to see you all again soon. Bye.